Dreams can make you cry. Dreams can make you laugh. Hello everyone, it's Lilac James and welcome back to another toy review video. Last week we reviewed the Calico Critters Chocolate Lounge, but this week I tried to say that all in one sentence and it didn't work. But this week we're going to be reviewing the oh, Calico Critters Tea and Treats set. So so, yeah, I'm pretty excited for that, but before we get into it, a little disclaimer is necessary. Although this video is a toy review video, it is not meant, it is not aimed for children, it is aimed for adults and teen collectors like myself. Anyway, with that out of the way, let's just take a look at the box. So, okay, so we have the box here. I've changed the angle and set up a little bit, so the sound might be slightly different, but we've got the box here. And like the other Calico Critters box, it's got like a really, really pretty teal lid and stuff. I didn't spend too much time on the other box. I'm not going to spend too much time on this one either. Um, it's got some, it's very reflective. It's got some pretty cool pictures on here. It says just kind of everything that it has. Some pictures and stuff. And it basically just looks like the other box. Here too. Um, I am pretty excited about this. I did notice, though, when I was doing the other one, that the couch was a little bit small for My Little Ponies. So, I guess we'll see. I'm guessing these chairs are probably going to be a little small. But the table shouldn't be, and all the food will be nice to have. So, it's 3+, plus, as you can see here. Critters and some accessories sold separately. I know that. And a warning. Choking hazard. Don't, don't choke on this toy. Also, when I originally got this, I looked at this and it's, and, and I know it's in a different language, I know that, but when I read it, it just, it's, <laughs> it totally, like, I read it as advertisement, pointless pieces. I know that's not what it says, but I read it as advertisement, and then pointless pieces. Anyway, that's not necessary. There's some more stuff on the bottom here, um, stuff over here, stuff over here. And yeah, it's a box. So we're gonna go ahead and open this. Again, I forgot to get scissors because I am not the most intelligent person. Um, I'm going to go get scissors. <laughs> okay, so here is the contents of the box. Um, just dump that out. There we go. Here is everything. I'm going to take the box, set it off to the side. So now we have all of the little accessories here. Um, they're pretty easy to take out. They just kind of slide out. Oh, they this plastic, it feels like very, I don't know. I, there's something about plastic toys, like especially like furniture like this, that I just really like. Anyway, they're this dark, they're like a dark green color. Um... Yeah, the table's a little tilty, but I think that might just be my set, because my set's not necessarily even. Yeah, it looks fine. Here's a little chair, and then I'll open these in a little bit here. Another little chair, and then, as you can see, this is actually all, like, in the display case. And it wasn't like this with the other one. I had to cut everything open, but this is actually really nice how it's all displayed out like this in this little plastic bit. So I'm going to open this, and then we'll just take a look at everything right off the bat. So, first, there's this little platter here. It's white, and it's got some pretty detailing on there. Um, I need to get this piece out. I don't want to flip this over. I don't know if I can get this piece out. Oh. Are these Mac Mindy all going to fall out? Okay. Yeah, they are. Oh, boy. Okay, so we got this. These are very small pieces. Okay, we've got this piece here, and it just clicks onto there. Oh yeah, yeah, okay, so here's the platter I'll put together, if I can get this to focus. There we go, so here's the platter, and just stick that on the table over here, oh this is stuck to me. Um, next we've got this little teapot, and here it is, it's pretty cute, it's, it's just a little white teapot, it's got a little lid. Next, there is this little, um, I don't know what it's called. It's like a cake thing. Um, it looks just like the one I got in the last set. There's no cake in this set, but that's okay. 
So I'm just going to stick that over there. And then we also have got some little macaroons here. So that's going to be fun to take out. Just going to dump them out there. So yep, they look just like the other ones in the last set. They also feel about the same. They feel like plastic, but at the same time they feel kind of foam-ish. Um, if you want a better description of that, I suggest checking out last week's video. But you can just kind of stick them on the table here. It's kind of hard for you guys to see. Let me just adjust the camera angle here. So here's the set from like a different angle. Um, and like I said earlier, there's a lot of detailing on these chairs. Just a little close up on it. So that's what the chairs look like. Um, the table has the same pattern, just obviously like this. And we'll get to size comparison in a minute here, but I'm gonna open up all these chocolates and plates and then I'm gonna show them to you guys. Okay, so I've got everything out now and the, they all look the same. So I'm just gonna show you one here. But here's the plate. Can we focus on it? Yeah, there we go. So there's the plate. It's pretty cute. And then it just, I mean, there's not really room on the table. I'm not really sure where you're supposed to stick this. There's not really room for everything on the table. It's kind of a small table. Um, and then we've got a cup here. Again, I don't think it's going to focus on it. But here's a, there's just a little cup. Um, they're empty. You can stick a macaroon in there. And now you have macaroon tea. There you go. Perfect. Macaroon tea. Everyone wants some macaroon tea. So. Yeah, um, but that is basically about it for this set. Here it is, just in its entirety. I'm going to get some LPS and My Little Ponies to just kind of show you some size comparison. So if you got a My Little Pony, it can fit on this table really well, actually. And I think I might start using this table as my default My Little Pony table because of how well they fit. They actually fit on the chairs extremely well, too, compared to the last set. They can reach everything just fine, and it's actually really cute and then i'm gonna get some lps lps can definitely not fit at this table but on the chair they can fit it's a little short for them but that's okay because i mainly make videos with my little pony anyway so it doesn't really matter if their table is a little short it can work it, it'll definitely work if you need it to but at the same time like it does it is a lot shorter than i figured it would be from lps i figured it would be more lps sized versus my little pony sized but it's not compared to the chocolate lounge we did last week also, if you if I keep referencing the chocolate lounge, just because it's the only Calico Creators thing I have to compare to this, so that's what I'm using to compare it to. And I still totally think you should check out that video, top right corner, if I didn't already link it up there. Um, but yeah, so it's pretty cute. Here's another LPS just for a second comparison. Um, and then I didn't show you the chocolates yet, but I don't think the video is gonna let me. Um, this one is like, um, there's like a little brown truffle with some, like, frosting detailing and a red cherry along with, a, like, a triangle truffle. This one has a rose and a heart. Um, and this one has, like, a Reese's peanut butter cup and a truffle with a little white dot in the middle. So yeah, their chocolates and everything with Calico Critters is super, super detailed, which I've definitely, re like, realized or seen but I just wanted to compare the thing we got, the couch we got last week, right here, with the chair. Like, they look about the same, but a mild pony can't fit on both of them. So, just wanted to say that. Anyway, I think this set is super cute. I'd try to set it up like the picture, but honestly, I don't think everything's going to fit on the table like it does in the picture. Because the table's surface area, it's a lot, it's a lot smaller than it looks in the picture. Um, I can try to fit everything, but I really don't think it's gonna fit ah again these sets make my fingers feel really big so yeah i don't even really want to try setting everything up because i don't think i'm gonna be able to i don't think there's really enough room on here i mean i guess you can get most of the stuff on there i suppose but it's really crowded <laughs> There we go. I'm not gonna go- I'm not gonna put the macaroons or anything on there because my fingers are really big. Um, I feel like to set this stuff up for, like, sets and stuff, I'm gonna have to get, like, myself a pair of tweezers and just, like, stick them on there. Because otherwise, there's no way I'm gonna get precision. But here, again, is the entire set. I think it is super adorable. Make sure to let me know what you guys think of this set in the comments down below. Also, update from last video, I got my cutie mark fixed, so... Yeah.
Also, if I keep referencing last videos because I want you to watch it and because I just filmed it like yesterday, so <laughs> I'm filming them all like really closely together. And actually, spoiler for next week, this is next week's review, so keep an eye out for that. Make sure you subscribe. Anyway, thank you for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, remember to dream on. Bye, everyone!